Hey guys, it's Joe from Bull and Garage. Today I'm going to teach you how to replace a grill on an Audi A4 B6 body style. There isn't really any YouTube videos to my knowledge of people doing this, so today I'm going to show you how to do it. So let's get started. So first and foremost, to get at the grill you have to pop the hood. Because then you'll just fucking break it, so. You gotta go into your car here, your Audi, here's the hood latch. Pop it up, come back over here, release the hood, it's hard doing this in one fucking hand, lift it up, and then the grill's directly attached to the hood, so what you're looking at over here, it's hard to see at this angle, but all there is, and I'll put a picture in the description, there's a couple of tabs holding this in, that's all it is. It's in so I'm going to go ahead and start removing the tabs. What you're going to use for the tabs, though, is uh, going to use a nice pair of pliers, preferably probably needle nose would work better. And then I'll start disassembling the grill and we'll come back after it's all got out. Alright so as you can see the grill is no longer attached to the car. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it up. And as you can see these now you can I'll rest it down so you can look at a better angle. But these uh these clips right here are the ones that you disassemble all this top row and there's should be two on these on well actually one on each side I should say sorry and you disassemble the uh, the top not the bottom part by towards the bottom of the envelope but like I said I'll put some pictures in the description with that area circled so you could follow along it's pretty simple self-explanatory and over here as you can see this is my new grill it came directly from uh, Audi I want the stride, to, I want to keep the car as stock as possible, because that's just me, I like keeping things stock, so let's go ahead and uh, get my knife and we'll unbox this thing real quick. Just undo these. Okay, opened up the box. Let's pull it out. Here is the replacement one. It's not really that different from the one I have, but this one, as you can see up close, there's all these pits in the in it because of course it's only plastic, but there's all these pits from all the pebbles on the highway and shit. So I just I don't like that. I like I'm a perfectionist. I want everything to be good. So here is the brand new one. Already out of the box. I like it a lot better. This one has like more for the S4 and Sport package styles. I don't believe my car was a Sport package model. But let me just pull this out of plastic real quick. I'll be right back. And here's the brand new one. Of course, it's all shiny. And see if you can look up close. Like it doesn't look as different as the other one, but. The inserts, instead of being just flat black, they're actually uh, metallic silver slash gray, you could say. It spruces it up a little bit. Probably down the line I'll buy a Quattro badge for it. For like over in this side, like how this one has it over here. And of course, you can see, I'll put them side to side for a second. Like, just a slight difference, but to me it makes it look a hell of a lot better. So... I'm guessing it's just plug and play from the rest to over here I'm guessing because I was scared there's a little adhesive on the other one I was scared I had to re-glue that but I don't think so so I'm gonna go ahead and probably put it together with the hood open I'm guessing and let's plop the one here. grabbing that and you simply just snap it back in so let me just get this situated and we'll come back 
this is my side nut this is after I put the grill in but when putting the taking the tabs out rather be sure when you take the needle nose pliers you compress them so the tabs are freely they're moving freely and they're not on the uh, they're not on the attached to the hood anymore so that's how you pop it out okay okay guys as you can see by that shine the new grills in just a side note though when you go back to install it these four clips at the bottom of the screen here here I'll point out one of them can't see with this camera <laughs> yeah so these four clips see there's three others over there be sure when you're putting the grill back on make sure these are slit slid under underneath attached to the hood and not caught underneath here because what happened was the one all the way down to the right was caught underneath the hood and it wouldn't snap the last thing wouldn't snap in because that wasn't secured how it was supposed to do so just that's it but quick and easy mod to your car makes it look a little better let me drop the hood it's a little loud but look at that way better way better difference it makes to the car when it when it's all done even though my my hood's still chipped up it's all right i'll fix it some other time when i have money i should say <laughs> but this grill was a, was still a lot of money but it was well worth it in my opinion makes the car look a little bit more leaner faster not as much as like a stock a4 anymore even though like i said i like the stock look but kind of looks like an s4 now it looks more racy like when i bought it I, i'll see if i could put a before picture in in it too i'll show you before the front didn't look as aggressive as of how it does now with the euro headlights in it and my German plate makes it look a little faster. Even though I really didn't do anything to the engine yet. Unless, other side note, look at this. I never showed you this. We got Bull and Garage banners now. If you want any of them, hit us up in the comments section below or message us. And we'll be happy to make one for you. We'll give you a price. So yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I'm probably not going to wash it tonight because it's a little chilly out. It's starting to get chilly out and dark, so I probably won't see what the hell I'm doing, but... Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you a little bit. If you still are stuck on something and confused, like I said, just message us on Bull and Garage on either YouTube, comment on the video, or email us. So, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, give us a like, subscribe. There'll be more where this came from. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys.